fashion haul. I recently picked up some items from Bobble Bar, Victoria's Secret Pink, and Primark. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got. So the first stuff I'm going to show you is from Bobble Bar. I haven't purchased from there in a while because I feel like the prices have increased and stuff and it got kind of expensive. But I did get a 25% off coupon so I thought it was a good opportunity to pick up some stuff that I wanted. Also, they started this new thing where if you spend $50, you get a free item, a free like jewelry piece, and they have like different ones you can choose from. So I thought that was a good deal as well. So the first thing I got is the Amber Layered Wide Chain Necklace, and it was $48. It was kind of pricey, but I've wanted it for a while, so I decided to finally pick it up. It comes in three colors. It comes in this gold color. It comes in rose gold, and it comes in silver. I really like this piece. I think it looks really good with v-necks and button-up shirts and stuff like that. It's so pretty. It's like a smaller choker and then a longer piece and then this other piece that comes to two points. I just think it's a really pretty necklace and I've been wearing it a lot. So this was the first piece I got. This next piece is called the Abbey Y Choker in rose gold. It was on sale for $20. I believe this also comes in gold and silver. I'm not 100% sure so I will link it below. But I thought this was also really pretty. I like the little tassel at the bottom. This is definitely more of a choker necklace where all, both layers are more high up to on your neck. But it's really pretty and I don't really own anything like it. So I thought that was pretty. And between the two I spent over $50 so I was able to pick a free item from a bunch of different necklaces and earrings you had, they had to offer. And the one I picked was the Lucky Layer Necklace in gold. This is normally $32. It's just a two layer necklace with these little balls, um, like decorative balls on it. This may come in silver as well, I'm not 100% sure, but I just thought it was really pretty. I'm really liking the layered look. I've always liked it, but recently I've been really liking these three. I've been wearing them a lot. So those, that's what I picked up from a bobble bar. Next is Victoria's Secret Pink. I picked up another one of their promotions that they had going on. This one I believe was either $40 or $50 and you get a cropped hooded sweatshirt and a pair of leggings. The hooded sweatshirt, there were three colors, the maroon, mint, or pink, and then the leggings you could get black or a uh, gray colored. So I picked up the maroon sweatshirt. Like I said, it's hooded. And then there's some stripe down the side of the arm. And once again, as I mentioned, it's cropped. And then the second is just the high-waisted leggings. It comes up past your belly button. It has some mesh on the leg right here. And then it says pink on the bottom. And as I mentioned, they are high-waisted. So that's all I picked up at Pink. And the last things are from Primark. The first thing I picked up is a sweater. It was $18 and I got it in a 6 to 8. It's a cold shoulder gray sweatshirt. It has little, you know, holes down the side with this grommet detailing. It's like a sil uh, silver metal type thing on the shoulders. I think it's really cute. It's shorter in the front and longer in the back, and the shirt is meant to be more baggy. So that's that. Next, I picked up a bodysuit, just another plain bodysuit like the last one. This one is like a peacock blue. It's three-quarter length, it has a scoop neck, it has a bikini bottom, and I got it in a four. Normally I would get a six, but these run a little big. I also got a beanie, like a head beanie for like $1.50 and I lost it. I have no idea where I put it. So yeah, I'm kind of annoyed about that. I looked all over for it for like a half hour the other day and I just can't find it. I might have thrown it out. I really don't know. I also got some tea towels which were like $3.50 um, hand towels or whatever for the kitchen. 
I got this Primark fleece for $8. Uh, it's a throw. It's really soft. They had a bunch of really cute throw blankets there. I had a hard time choosing which one I want. I'm sure I'll be back and get to get some more. So the last thing I picked up is this crossbody bag from Primark. It was $12. This summer I got a 9 West crossbody bag that was bigger than like a wristlet size but smaller than a purse and I never realized how much I was going to end up using it and I really wished I grabbed it in a black but I didn't. So I've been on the search for something that's bigger than a wristlet but smaller than a purse because I felt I feel like when I use my smaller bags they're just not big enough when I want to go to the mall or something like that. It's fine going to a bar or something but if I have more than my keys my phone, a lipstick, my cards, and stuff like that. It gets kind of tight in those type of bags. So that's why I picked this up. It's a little bit bigger than nine, the 9 West one, but I think it's really cute. These false, these are false zippers. I wish they were real, but for $12 I really can't complain. I really like the cute little tassel thing right here. This is a magnetic closure. There's a little zipper on the inside and there's plenty of space in here. But like I said, it's still smaller than a regular bag. It doesn't feel heavy like you have this big purse with you. So it's good when I don't want to bring my regular bag. And when it also has a nice adjustable strap on the, on the um, strap part. It's just really cute and it's a good size. And I've been using it a lot and for $12 you really can't go wrong. So those are all the items I picked up recently. I will post down below all the items that are available online for you to purchase. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, post it down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Until next time, thanks guys. Bye.